Yeah. What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. What's up, y'all? About to give you another video. And this video is like real life. I'm going to tell you something that like I don't understand. I will never understand this, so please bear with me. I'm going to talk about how people will completely talk straight out of their ass just to prove themselves right. How people will make up shit on the fly to justify their bullshit ass points. Like I said, I, I talked about this earlier. I put up a video which I got from another YouTuber, Fearless. I watched his video and I put, the, I put the link up in the group. How he couldn't go back to America because he gave up his passport or his citizenship or whatever. Look up the video. I'm not going to go in detail because I, I cut it up. Well, people were coming with all sorts of crazy ass bullshit. I was like, they said, I, well, and, and it wasn't it wasn't relevant to the point at hand. And this is where I get mad because it, was not, it wasn't like it was relevant to the to the topic at hand. They were like, they were they said something about the avatar or, or the picture they used. You do know that picture was from uh, his documentary, and um, I was like, I do a shift the picture from him jumping rope or playing hopscotch. Is he allowed in the country? How's that going? On? How's that affect him from not not being allowed in the country? Just from a, like people. That's why I don't like. That's why I don't like. I like YouTube. I like Ustream. I like uh, maybe Twitter. I like that more because. I can give you my opinion, and I can tell you my opinion, and you know exactly where I stand. On Facebook, you got a lot of fuckery going on, where motherfuckers want to switch hit it up on a fly, and they want to like tell you something one minute, then when you call them out, it's like, well, I technically didn't say that. I'm like, get the fuck out of here, you know what I mean? You know, and the hard part about it is a clear majority of people well, let them do this bullshit. Like, do even have a, a peanut galley? Well, he's, you know he's right. Or, like I said, I made a point, and I told him, what they'll do is they'll talk about something. I, I talk, we'll talk about this in a podcast, I think. They'll make up stuff that's actually a fact. Like, they, something that you can't deny. That's true, they come with a fact, but it's a fact that has nothing even remotely related to what you're talking about. You'll talk, like I said, you'll talk about something, maybe you'll talk about, oh, well, well, the, well, Super Bowl, Seattle blew out the Colts. And then they get so heat, they start making up facts and I'm going to go, well, you do know young cats are called kittens, right? And they'll talk, they'll talk about like they're fucking a Harvard fucking professor. And then, and then you're like, you're in the back of your mind, you're like, what the fuck? You're like, you're like where did he come with that? And what, meanwhile, you're trying to figure out where they came with that. There were like two or three cheerleaders on the side. Yes, he's right. You know kittens are young cats. I don't know why you're, I'm like, you're like, what the fuck? Like, really? This is like I, that's why I don't like debates or talking about on Facebook. I like I like this more. I'll go on Facebook because I have to do the social media thing with the position I'm in. Other than a high position, you said you got to do it. But in this day and age, and another thing, people think yelling is telling the truth. It's because you like if if you yell and I don't, I stop talking. I stop talking because I just don't want to deal with your ignorance. Like people can't like there's there's people from a situation and this is not just on the internet. There's been real life situations. Cause I caught a motherfucker. Well, I ain't gonna say I caught somebody doing that. That was one time. Somebody was doing trying to do some slick shit behind the scenes. Well, I knew what they were doing because I, I I I read a lot. I read into shit a lot of hands. Sometimes I'm wrong. Don't get me wrong. And so, but most of the times I'm dead on. Well, I was dead on. So I was like talking. I was doing what they were doing, but I was being a little bit more slicker. I was talking about the situation. I said, I don't know why people worry about this in the fifth. I said, and no, that's usually hypocrites. But this person trying to explain themselves. I said, I'll listen. And when they not, not explain them, I said, well, if that's the case with A, how can you be consistent with B? And then it was, well, you didn't let me talk. You didn't let I'm like, really? If you want, and then she, then, then this person tried to, tried to yell. So I was like, first, all right, I yell too. So it was weird, just having, and then she got to the point, and I was like, whatever, man. 
Oh, I can't talk to you. Yeah, you can't talk to me because you can't bullshit me. That's the problem with a lot of you little ham and eggers out there. A lot of you peasants. You'll come over here. You'll try to bullshit other people because maybe they'll let you go. Maybe they don't understand. And then you come bullshit me, and I'm like, no, man, you can piss on my leg and I'll punch you in the fucking throat. You know, so I, I try to stay away from these. I advise you to do it too. Stay away from these weak-minded people. Stay away from you know. Don't get caught up in the dog fight. Never the dog has no legs and no arms to fight. Cause then you'll look like a bad guy. So just, I just stay away from these people. It's just disgusting. All right, you know. Kill the videos. Kill my vibe. Talk about you fucking ignorant folks. Come on here, please. It's not.